Hey, what's up? My name is Tim from MotorGearExpert.com and today I'm bringing you a video of the Oxford Boss Alarm. It's an alarm to disc lock and I'm going to tell you two things I don't like about the, di uh, the disc lock and two things I like about the disc lock. Um, so let's start with the cons so that we can keep the good stuff for later. Let me start with something small. It's not a huge issue, but oh, it's just a little, little failure I think. It's the shape of the key. It's a uh, half a circle. I don't know if you can see. Yes, you can. Um, so it only fits the lock in one way, so it will fit like this, and you can open it, but it doesn't fit the other way. So what happens, every time you try to unlock your bike, um, you have to try which side the, the key should go, and in some cases the alarm goes off because you're moving this, this uh, alarm uh, too much. So I don't really like that. I've had a lot of occasions where people are looking at me like, are you stealing a bike? Uh, well, all I do is just mess with the key. So that's the first thing I don't really like about this lock. The second thing I don't really like is, um, well, you can use this lock in two ways. You can use it when it's alarmed and when it's not alarmed. You simply put the bracket like this or the other way around. And I'll show you, there's a little, um, uh, how do you say, a red arrow here and a red arrow here. If you put the red arrows together, that means the alarm is locked. Uh, well, it's locked and alarmed. Um, so the alarm will go off in case you, yeah, you mess up uh, the alarm. Um, if it's like this, where the red arrow is on the opposite sides, uh, it's not alarmed. The thing is, if you put it on your bike, on the wheel, um, usually it's like quite tight and you can't really tell where the red arrows are. So I don't really like that. I think it's easy to solve this. They should just make the bracket red, half of it and half of the lock itself. And then, uh, yeah, it's fixed. So something to, for Oxford to, to think about for a new version. So the first reason I like this lock a lot is because it's just so small. It fits underneath my seat, my naked bike. Um, I don't have any boxes or anything to store stuff, so I can't take my chain. I've got a big chain, which is more secure than the desk lock, but it, I just can't take it. Um, this one fits right in, right here. I take it with me all the time, and whenever I have to stop, uh, when I didn't expect it, I still have a lock with me to secure my bike and it's alarmed. The last reason I like this lock so much is just, well, it's quite obvious, but because it's alarmed. Um, I'll show you what happens if you put it on your, on your wheel and someone tries to mess with your lock. So first of all, you just take the bracket off like this. Um, you look at the red arrows right here, you put them together. So you do like this. The red arrow is on this side, so I have to turn the lock, put it on, lock it, it beeps and now it's locked. Um, if someone tries to mess up with the lock now, um, it the alarm will go off. I'll show you in a second. One thing to keep in mind is put the reminder cable on at all times. So you just put the cable to your, um, to your steering wheel. Um, what you don't want is that you forget your lock. You try to, to, to drive away and you'll fall, you'll break your bike. So always use the reminder lock, uh, the reminder uh, um, cable. Um, I'll show you well what happens if the alarm goes off, so I'll mess with it a bit and then I'll, uh, I'll unlock it and the alarm will stop. So first you'll hear a, a beep, it will warn people around that it's an alarm lock and then a second or two later the alarm will go off. There you go, that's it. So yeah, I think it's a great feature. Um, it makes me feel much safer if I can't watch my bike. I still know someone is watching my bike, in this case, the lock. Um, so it's a big pro for me. So to summarize, should you buy this lock? There's two minor issues, the shape of the key and um, of course the little red arrows, um, but they're just really minor. Uh, what I do like is um, that the lock is small. It fits in my naked bike, which doesn't have any cases to, to store stuff, but it still fits under the, under the seat. Another thing that I like is the alarm. It just makes me feel much safer than a lock without an alarm. So stay tuned, uh, check my channel for more videos and I'll talk to you later. See ya!